Are you calling? I am. You want to step out where we can talk real quick? You know what this card is? So we got a tip from the FBI saying that uh, somebody from your old address over there in Traditions yeah. had made a threat to shoot up a school. For real? Yes, sir. And your name was associated with that address. So we went over to that address and you weren't living there. So yeah, we live here. Let me get dressed. Sure. Working nights. Uh, yeah, yeah. I at least wear pajama bottoms when I answer the door. At least try to. Come to the door, in my underwear. Unless it's in the middle of the night. I, I usually have a door. gun in my hand. Yeah. A gun in my hand. Yeah. I had a thing over on Davenport Road. Mm -hmm. Guy had stumbled through this person's yard, knocked on the door, dropped. When he left, he walked through a fence and tumbled into the ditch, mm -hmm. lost his phone. So I picked his phone up, and it was one of those last calls. Mm -hmm. So I put it in an evidence bag, and I was like, and it was on the weekend, so I was like, nobody's going to be messing with this. Yeah. So I put it in an evidence bag. Forgot to take by the office. Went home. I had somebody showing up on my doorstep at two o'clock in the morning, beating yeah. on the door. Wife comes in there and like, "Hey, there's somebody at the front door." Went out there. They were gone. But I called uh, uh, Griff. Mm -hmm. He came out there and checked it out. Sorry, boys. That's all right. Yeah, Sorry, I got up watching the golf tournament and sat back down. That was Ow. it. That was it. Yeah. So what? Tell me what. You have any kids or anything? Yeah, right? Colt Gray. Colt? Yeah, Colt. He's my older son. How old is he? He's 13. Does he play a lot of video games and stuff? Yeah, he does. Play it all the time. Is he here right now? Yeah. But, you think that's something he, he might have? I damn sure want to know. Can we talk to him? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Now look. He going to get all red face when you talk to him. Just calm all right, right. so we're, him and his give me let me give you a backstory so okay. we lived over traditions mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I went to work one day I'm sole provider no. build high rises downtown mm -hmm. so I get a call from one of y'all like so my family's in law enforcement so when I get the call I don't think the officer's name turns out nicest guy like ever He's like, I just want to let you know I'm at your house. I'm like, for what? He said, y'all have been evicted. I'm like, no, I just paid rent. And he's like, no. Nope. He's like, I'm going to stay here till you get here. So I drove all the way home. All my shit's in the front yard. And I'm like, what are you doing? He's like, I'll just let you know this is what's going on. There's people standing there with trailers and shit. And I'm like, what are they doing? He's like, well, they're going to get your stuff after 24 hours. Is that right? I don't even know why y'all are here. So, long story short, I'm like, trying to figure out what's going on with my wife. She's in the house. So, we split. Long story short, for obvious reasons. She took my younger two and went back home to live with her mom. Colt and I rented a house and came here. Mm -hmm. So, we've been good. Like, no problems. Um, he struggled at first with the separation and all. School was kind of so so. So I've been up at school countless times just tracking with him, you know. Like, mm -hmm. hey, make sure you're good. They understand what's going he on. He goes to Jefferson School? He goes to Jefferson uh, Middle School. Yes, so he's been doing really good. Like, you know, in the beginning he kind of he kind of struggled a little bit. Um, but Let me ask you this. Do you, have any, do you have weapons in the house? I do. Are they accessible to him? They are. I mean, there's nothing, nothing loaded, but they are down. We do, we actually we do a lot of shooting. We do a lot of deer hunting. He shot his first deer this year. Yeah. Okay. You know, so 
Like, I'm pretty much in shock, to be honest with you. Well. I'm a little pissed off, to be even really honest with you, if that, if that is what was said. But, well, the, the and we've been up to the school for so many times now. The information I got was sort of incomplete, and I don't know how old it is. Um, and, like I said, the, the original complaint went to your other address, or your, your previous address. Mm -hmm. And that's where we just came from, and it, it wasn't them. Yeah, no, I'm sure <laughs> so, it wasn't. I don't know if, yeah, so we, we ran your, I had your name and date of birth, so yeah. that's how we got this address. So, I mean, we've been, I swear to God, we went up to school. I've been up to school, like, come on, first name. But I just was up there three days ago for his finals, make, talking to the principal, like, look. No. Make sure Colt's good. He gets flustered and under pressure. He doesn't really think straight. Can mm -hmm. we just... You know, just kind of put your arms around, him, get him through seventh grade. I just want to make sure he's good. Like, I mean, we're up there all the time talking yeah. to school. Okay. If you talk to that school, they'll know exactly who I am. I'll say that. Okay. <laughs> I mean, because I'm up there that much. Yeah, yeah. You know? Checking in on him. Yeah. Sure I just good. want to make sure he's good. Yeah. Um, so I'm a little taken back by the whole thing, but I can tell you this I take that very serious, and, and so does he, as a matter of fact. You know, he's. It says his first name's Colt. Colt, C O L T, yes, sir. I mean, all I can do is ask him. Yeah, well, absolutely. Yeah, and yeah. I want you to talk to him and just t just tell him. Like, I don't know. I I don't know anything about him saying any shit like that, and I'm gonna be mad as hell if he did. And then all the guns will go away, yeah. and they won't be accessible to him. You know, we. I'm trying to be honest with you, I'm trying to teach him about firearms and safety and how to do it all and get him interested in the outdoors, mm -hmm. like on my phone. And get him away from those video games. He, exactly right. That's the that's the God honest truth. And yeah. his, the picture on my phone is him with blood on his cheeks from shooting his first deer. It right. was just the greatest day ever. Yeah, so sure. he knows the seriousness of weapons and what they can do and how to use them and not use them. So it's kind of a, no need. It's kind of a little bit of a shock. So, in whatever y'all are telling him, please instill in him that what if this is whatever or wherever this has come from is no joke. Yeah. Like it's no joke. But we wouldn't be here if it was. No, I know, I know, and yeah. I'm telling you right now, we talk about it quite a bit. Okay. All the school shootings, things that happen. Yeah. All, scary. Hey, are you getting picked on at school? He is. He's getting picked on at school, and. Is everything okay? That's why I keep going up there. Yeah. You know, because you just never, you never really know, and I don't want anything to happen to him. So, mm -hmm. um, yeah, y'all. Right, well, if you want to grab him, yeah, y'all talk. Or we can go in. And it's Sounds all cool. Hang on. Yeah. One information, yeah. Hey, Colt, what's going on, bud? So, did your dad kind of explain everything to you? He said something about shooting up a school. Did you say something about school shooting? Traditions, or was it here? No, it was a traditions because in that Discord account that I had, I had deleted it before. Because before you moved here? Yeah, because I think it got like it meant password pool or something. Like I clicked on a link and somebody. Had Have you heard anybody on Discord when you were using it say something like that? You remember? Like at that time? Yeah. Um, I don't think so. I don't think I ever had anybody that. Never. And I, I mean, I'm not trying to get anybody hemmed up, but like, this is some serious stuff. Yeah, I know. Oh, he knows how serious it is, trust me. Because I'd, I'd, I'd hate to, 
Yeah, my boss was even like, you know, I don't know how old this information is, and if you want to wait till Monday to follow up, I was like, nah, I'd rather do it now, because so would we. Because God forbid something happened, and I didn't yeah. do my job, that'd be, that, I, I'd feel pretty bad about that. So I just want to make sure you understand that if, if something like that happens or you hear something like that, report it. Yeah, yeah. Tell, sure. tell your dad, tell and teacher. I, like whatever. I told him, I would promise I would never say something. Like so you haven't used Discord in a few months, oh, no, I, and I, you're 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 saying you didn't say anything. No, the only thing I have is TikTok, but I just go around there and watch the videos. Okay. Alright, well, well, fair enough. What's your birthday? He's just going to do a little report saying that uh, we talked. We've done reference to this and that we talked, and you saying that we didn't say anything like that. And I, I got to take it at your word, and I hope you're being honest with me. I'm not saying you're lying, but it's. It's it's not unusual for people to lie to police. Okay. <laughs> He's familiar with that too. <laughs> hey Colin, what's a good phone number for you, sir? Uh, okay. How's school going? Oh, it's going good here. About about ready to get done with it? I already finished. Uh, oh, you did? Yeah. When was, when was your last day? Um, let's say Sunday, so Friday. Friday? Uh, what grade are you going into? Uh, eighth grade. Eighth grade, almost high school, man. Yeah. The last four years, really, the last four years is what matters. Yeah. Get, get them good grades, man. It'll set you up for the rest of Yeah, so look, it, it, you all are welcome any time. We take it like dead serious around here, and I just want to just want to make sure that I'd even feel better if you do find out what or where. Mm -hmm. Like, can somebody let us know? Cause sure. He, he'll, he's going to be full of anxiety until this gets resolved, I can tell you that right yeah, now. I, I've never really said something related to yeah. So did you switch schools when you moved uh, from okay. Traditions? Where were you going before? Uh, West Jackson. West Jackson yeah. Middle? Okay. Is um, things a lot better now? Oh, yes, sir. Okay. That's good. It's, let uh, me let me grab you one. Can I walk through the grass? I'm going to grab a car real quick. Yeah, it's all good. Are you getting bullied over there at West Jackson Middle? Um, that's hey. the thing. I wasn't back there. Oh, yeah. I wasn't getting now, bullied. Now, look, be honest with him about um, that. Yeah. Now in middle school. I told him you were now. And that's you getting, getting switched out halfway through the school year? Being the new guy? Yeah. Well, my dad was a logger and grew up in the military. We moved a lot when I was a kid. Yeah. Well, so. in the past schools, I was surprised that I wasn't, I, know, I had friends, like I didn't even necessarily have a reason that I would say that or anything. Yeah. Yeah. Well, there's always somebody you can talk to if you need to. Yeah, yeah, sure. All right. School resource counselors. Yeah, and I do talk to them. Yeah, I talk to that counselor quite often. Um, oh, okay. Yeah, start looking out, making goals for yourself. Yeah, I'll do that. You interested in anything? Uh, I want to be a philosopher. I want to go up. A what? A philosopher. A philosopher. Yeah. It's kind of an out there thing. But yeah. Well, I mean, do what you enjoy. Yeah. I mean, I did 20 years in the military. You don't have to settle on just one thing. Yeah. I did 20 years in the military, retired from that, and been doing this for seven. So. Okay. You don't have to fit everything inside the box. Yeah, that might branch out to different states. No. We got guys at the sheriff's office are full time plumbers, full time police officers and you know. Do what pays the bills. Do what they enjoy. But everything's going good. Yeah, now they have that's good. You got a phone? What's your phone number? Uh, like I said, I, I changed my phone number. And okay. I just my All right. Dad said you went deer hunting for the first time this past year. Oh, yeah. What'd you get? Um, a three pointer. Three pointer? Yeah, it was nothing much, but I still 
fork on one side and one on the a prong on the other or uh, it was one on one side and two, you know, three yeah. Or so, yeah. Yeah, fork fork on one side and yeah. one on the other. Spike. Yeah. I seen more uh, one antler deer this year than any other time in my life. Out there in rut and breaking off a yeah. Yeah. an antler, yeah. running around with just yeah. one set of antlers. <laughs> well, look, Cole, I appreciate it. Your dad's got my card. Um, if anything, if you hear anything, tell your dad. He's got my number. Yeah, it's, it's serious. He, he knows how serious it is, and yeah. he'll, uh, like I said, we'll have a long conversation here in just a little bit. And if something, you know, we, it, it's a pretty traumatic thing that we, him and I both went through now. He was at school, I was at work, come home, and I mean, every ounce of what we had was under tarps and sitting in that yard. You saw it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You saw the clientele, the neighbors that live there. It was like fully embarrassing. So uh, it was I very. Mean, Traumatic right. for both sure. of us, and living here just us is like dust is finally settled. Mm -hmm. He's making good grades, so that's good. We'll keep that up. That's, we'll, that's important. We'll start talking about traditions in West Jackson and just see if something jogs his memory okay. like that. But um, certainly, we'd like to know if something. If you do find, well, my thing is this: so more than likely, they track the IP address, okay. and that's why we went to that address. Okay. Because the IP addresses are usually location specific, yep. you know, within an area. So if it came from that house, then either somebody there is lying, or the information is just so old. Yep. And you know, maybe it was something he heard or did on Discord months ago. I don't know. I have no idea. Okay. So, but he's telling me he didn't. Yep. Telling me he can't remember anything like that. And yep. I, you know, I take you at your word. Okay. Yes, if you look me in the eye and you tell me that's what you're telling me. I got no choice but to take it to work right now, but yes, sir. but like I was telling your dad, if we find out otherwise, then it's a different story, okay? It's a really different story, okay? Yeah. Got, got any questions? No, sir. You have any okay. questions? Yes, sir. All right, I'll go the rest of your day. Yeah. Thank you. Appreciate, Appreciate it. Appreciate it, sir. Y'all be safe. Good luck to you. I'm going to knock out a port. You want me to do it? It don't matter. It's just going to be a information or agency assist made contact with these people uh they had no idea the husband said that he hasn't mm. been on discord and since fantasy football and, yeah uh and then colin made contact with him and then brought his son and got his date of birth brought him out and spoke to him uh apparently he was getting bullied yeah. uh very soft-spoken reserved kid yeah Pretty much unable to substantiate anything at this point. No. And until we get more information from this so-called tip from the FBI, then I don't know. Where got dad's phone number, so we'll just do an agency assist report for the FBI. Yeah.